Roswell Flight Desk Crew back here at CES 2015 in fabulous Las Vegas, Nevada. And I'm talking to Derek Hyung from Ehang. How are you doing, Derek? I'm good. How are you? I'm well, thank you. Now, you have got something extraordinary behind you. I've seen a lot of cool stuff here at CES this year, but this thing is in a league of its own. Why don't you tell us about it? This uh, big aero vehicle we are presenting today is called an Ehang 184. It's the very first autonomous aero vehicle, you know, manufactured uh, by us. This is a multi-rotor, as you can see. I mean, the Ehang 184, which is the product name, uh, you know, means one passenger, eight propellers, and four arms. It's purely electricity powered, and it's absolute safe by design because of the multi-rotor structure. You know about that. Yeah, how long will it fly for on a battery on one battery charge? So per battery charge right now, it will fly in 23 minutes, and the cruising speed is going to be 62, 63, uh, you know, miles per hour. So we are talking about like a, you know like a little bit over two, uh, like 20 miles. You has it flown yet with a human on board? Yes, we have tested over 100 times, and we did test with human being fly on board in low altitude in Guangzhou. You know, back in Guangzhou in China, you know where we are headquartered in. Now you look in the cockpit. There's no joystick, there's no throttle like you'd see in a conventional aircraft. How do you control it? You're going to see a surface pad over there. Vertically take off to plan out the route, it's, you know, it's all autonomous. So people don't have to go to a license, don't need to go to pilot school. And you know, what we want is like, you know, instead of being a pilot, you're a passenger. You can just like sit on there, enjoy and fly to your destination. Well, this thing literally took my breath away. So thank you for taking the time to tell us a little bit about it. It's amazing. Thank you very much. All right, and from CES 2015, this is the Roswell Flight Test Crews signing off. And Derek, thank you again.